What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. Today, we are back here at Alice Adventure to do some a lot, a lot of construction update. There's been a lot of news been happening a lot with Park, with the new Potter Coaster that just recently announced what it is and when it is coming out. There also been a lot of happening things at Jurassic Park area, referring to Jurassic World Roller Coaster. Um, there's a lot of things happening and later on today I'm actually going to head over to Universal to do the concert, I think Sabrina Carpenter I think I want to say. Well, without any further ado, why do we just jump out right in and have some fun right here? Let's go! But before I actually start walking around the park, the first thing I want to check out is be literally in front of the lagoon looking outward towards the Discovery Center of Jurassic Park. There's been a lot of things that I've seen right there. I'm like, yo, I need to see this in person. I've been saw a lot of tweets, I saw a lot of pictures, videos of what's going on, so I have no idea what's been happening for the past few days because a lot of things have changed. And oh my god, that's been interesting. Holy smokes. I'll show you guys in just a moment. Wow. They did a lot of demolition here. A lot of things. Right now, that's the best view I can see because literally they closed off Discovery Center from everyone who were the balcony from the last video that I talked when I was here and filmed it. If you haven't watched that video, go ahead and click the suggested video on the top right corner and it will definitely direct you to that previous video. But, we're gonna go over there, check out some new things, but also first we gotta check out Harry Potter because there's been major announcements happening right now. And oh my god, I'm getting speeches right now because I can't believe this is happening right now. I'll see you guys at Harry Potter. Alright guys, as you can see from before video, there used to be humongous cranes all over the place and now that's officially gone. There's been a lot of things changes right here and also some brand new announcements which we're about to cover in just a moment. I just need to find a good setup to talk to you guys about this. Alright, there's been a lot of things happening here at this location. There's been a brand new show they just announced right behind me that's got been popping on later on this year. It, are you guys even looking at me? Jesus Christ, that's like a bad angle. There, there, much better. I can, that's much better. But yeah, there's been a lot of brand new things that have been happening. The first of which, the part coaster that we've been speculating a long time that's gonna be something with Dean Hackett. They officially announced it is Hagrid's Magical Creature Motorbike Adventure. For the first time, for the first time ever, join Hagrid as he flies far beyond grounds of Hogwarts Castle on a thrilling roller coaster ride that plunges into the path of some of the Wizards World's rarest magical creatures. That right there, I'm literally just hyped for it because we've seen there's gonna be a trap door on the roller coaster that you're gonna be falling down. There's a back backward por portion of it there's so many things that this park really needed and we're finally got some brand new information also right behind me there's a Hogwarts castle normally there used to be uh, a magical night of Hogwarts castle which I did which I did watch it if you haven't seen that video yet go and click one of the, su the suggestion videos on top it'll take you directly to the video but the brand new nighttime show that's happening later on this year here in Orlando, but it's happening in March 23rd, I want to say, late March, and then it'll stop, and it'll come back mid-April, which is Dark Arts at Hogwarts Castle. As darkness falls on Hogwarts Castle, Dementors, Death Eaters, and other unspeakable creatures clothed of stone walls with sinister images from the dark side of magic. Experience the fire engulf army of Inferi, the soul drainer beneath the Dementors, and the haunted image of the one and only Lord Voldemort. As you stand unaware as the castle takes over, it's an ominous speculation of lights, music, and ink in coming soon select night to Universal's Island to Adventure. So that is one of the many new news that just happened recently here in Universal. Um, I tried looking around, there's honestly nothing brand new to watch. Oh, but I did see by someone's video that they are testing the tracks. 
you could actually see the motorbikes of it. Um, I could hopefully it's still around the, inter the internet. But if I do find it, here's the image. If not, um, I'm just gonna credit the video. The link to that video will be down in the description below. That where they talk about it. Um, but other than that, that's pretty much it for Hogwarts. Like I honestly cannot wait. I cannot wait for this at all. Oh, I don't know if I already said this, but. The roller coaster will be debuting on June 13th of 2019. We're only just a few months away. Oh my god. Well, with that being said, we're gonna go now to Jurassic Park to check out some brand new things because there's been a lot of movement going around. So yeah, let's go. Also, before I continue, the bridge that I mentioned right here, they completely destroy it. Rumor has it that because of the new Jurassic World roller coaster featuring Blue, it's gonna the, the track will take part right there, either above it and also maybe below it. As of right now, we don't know just yet, but rumors and they've been saying that they've got to reconstruct the the bridge before summer peak season. Fingers crossed it does because if it's not, there's gonna be a lot of traffic here. But now I've entered the Jurassic Park world. And now let's just see what the heck has been happening here in this side of the park. So here we are, Jurassic Park Discovery Center. Right across from us, they have this completely blocked off. And I'll show you guys in just a second. As you can see, they completely blocked the entrance with the trash can and all the chairs outside are completely closed off. How interesting is it? I actually went out here days before they closed it off. Is there probably someone from Universal watching one of my videos? Um, hey, if someone from Universal is watching my videos and saw what I did, um, please contact me. I would love to be part of some events from you guys. Please, fingers crossed. In my email, please. <laughs> but other than that, pretty much everything we can see. There's been, like I showed you the front of the park, there's nothing really much to see or do. But other than that, yeah, from this part. So let's continue walking down the Jurassic Park area and see what other things have been changing. Because there's been a lot of new things. Let's go. So as of right now, the Raptor encounter is still here for the moment. There's, um, there's been rumors saying that it's going to be gone within the next couple of weeks and be located next to um, this area right here, next to Jurassic Park River Adventure. Um, as of right now, we, there's been no word just yet about it, but um, just, I'm definitely going to keep an eye on that, um, seeing when will that change. Um, and also, Universal decided to implement something interesting along the walls. I'll show you guys just right now. So Universal decided to put cutouts of different dinosaur, raptors, blue the raptor, triceratops and the Tyr Tyrannosaurus Rex. I don't know what's the ideal of what Universal is trying to do right here, but there's a lot of things happening right here and a lot of interesting things. Jurassic Park River Avenger is back open after its annual refurbishment. It is a 25 minute wait. However, this video right here, it's not a roller coaster or an adventure moment. This right here is just a completely an updated video. And at the end, going to the Supreme Carpenter's concert and check it out live. Um, that's pretty much everything I can see here in Jurassic Park. There's been a lot of new things that have been happening, a lot of new things that popped up. But now, it's time to walk around a little more, see what other things that might have happened in the park. And if not, hop over to Universal and enjoy the concert. I'll, I'll keep you guys in the loop in just a moment to see what is new to see. So right over here, they used to have, there is a water ride. Really dudes, rips off falls. It was under refurbishment, but they just reopened it recently. But because they closed this ride, they closed this one right here where Popeye was. If you're more of a quote unquote log ride, um, single foul and drop down, then Rips Off All is your best option. But if you are more of a family wrapped and to get soaked from head to toe, Popeye is the best shot, best place. Um, it's under refurbishment, 
So you have to wait maybe a couple of weeks, maybe a month or two until it reopens sometime late spring, early summer. But I am definitely, definitely doing something because I have considered, because I've done a video on Jurassic Park River Adventure, I have to hide the camera, well not hide the camera, don't let the ca don't show nothing on the attraction, just showcase myself. I could do that with every single water right here. So, during the summer, I might do that, go on every single water right here and just have my facial expression, just go crazy and probably just get soaked. But, um, that is for a future video later on this year. But other than that, I think that's pretty much it wraps up for Islands of Adventure. Now, the next thing to do is go to um, Universal Studios and get ready for Sab Sabrina Carpenter's um, concert. So yeah, without any further ado, let's transition to um, Universal Studios. And just like that, here we are inside of Universal Studios. There's been a lot of things been happening at this park recently because right here, there is construction walls happening around this um, um, deli place that used to be. Um, there's been rumors saying that it's gonna be like a new cafe that's been happening. Um, I honestly don't know what to expect. Um, the Mardi Gras parade will have be happening later on today. I don't know what time, um, but the problem is, get go, try to catch the Mardi Gras parade or get a guest spot for the con for the concert because you can't do both. It's physically impossible. So, um, depending where I'm sitting, I might be getting a good view on it. But now I'm just probably gonna walk around and check out what other new things here are for Money Girl. Um, but yeah, with, I'll catch you guys in a moment when I know what to do right now because I honestly have no idea what to do next, honestly. <laughs> this is the first time I'm ever getting a brain part. So yeah, I'll catch you guys in just a moment. Okay guys, so pretty much I've done nothing. I probably will walk around a little bit, check out what's new, but I honestly didn't Watch see it. That. Oh, thank you for the heads up. No, but thanks for the heads up. Uh, but uh, <laughs> overall, I did pretty much do nothing. I just like, walked around a little bit, done nothing. Uh, check out if there's anything new, but around there's nothing new. Um, but I pretty much guess I got some good seats. Um, and it's this right here. So as of right now, this is my viewing spot for the concert. Um, I only probably heard like one or two concerts of Sabrina, so not concerts, two songs from her. But overall, I think it's gonna be a pretty good one. I cannot wait to see how good she is. The last time I saw her in general was when she was in Girl Meets World, which I was in love with that show. But yeah, I can't wait for the show to start. Such an incredible crowd uh, on our first that. show. I will never forget you guys and the energy you gave me tonight. I'm gonna sing one more song for you. It's not released. It's a it's a new song. I'm gonna sing one more song. Is that cool with you? This song isn't out yet, and um, it's something I'm a little hesitant to to release. Uh, Universal Mardi Gras has been a long time, but an amazing night, honestly. Thank you so much. 
Well, guys, time to wrap it up, and I'll see you guys in the car for the outro. Well, guys, that's gonna be the end of this video. Um, the reason I decided to not to film the last piece of the concert, the last encore of the show, um, is because Supreme Carpenter just said that um, this song is not released just yet. Um, this has been gone out to public. So, I personally decided not to record it or post it or do anything with it. Um, because I'm not that type of person who will just take something, use it on YouTube, use it as clipping and everything. Because that is just not my nature. That's completely not my nature. Um, but overall, that was just a really energetic concert. I really loved it. Um, like I said before, the last time um, I saw this chick was during when Boy Meets World, not Boy Meets World, the reboot of that Girl Meets World that was on Disney. I really loved that show. It was really amazing, really fantastic overall. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy this video. Um, I'm sorry it's kind of like on the short side of, of this um, because it, I was like really against time. Um, Recorded what I need to record, jump to the other park for the show and everything. But yeah, huh. um, I hope you do, guys. Again, did enjoy the video. If you're new to the channel, please hit the subscribe button. It means a lot to me to subscribe to this channel. Also, hit the little bell icon to be notified when brand new videos are up on this channel. Um, if you want to follow me on Instagram, the link to that will be down in the description below. And yeah, thank you so much, guys. And I'll catch you guys maybe. I'm a water park.